Yeah. Say good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to my channel, guys. It is Saturday morning, February 18th. We are up. We are about to head out. There's Bugs. Layla. Layla, you came to drop us off? Yes. Yes. We are on our way to Atlanta with Rosie and Reagan, taking Rosie to go look at some colleges. So here we go on our way to the airport. All right, guys, we have made it through TSA pre check. Now we're walking to our gate 10 over there. We're in the United Hub, which is completely different from the, I think, the last one we took. So, on our way. right here. The girls are over there. So, we in the thing. Got plenty of space, plenty of leg room. The girls got plenty of leg room. Really got plenty of leg room. We on the edge. We ain't gotta be fighting over this. We got nobody sitting next to us. Look at Rosie over there, real comfortable. All right, guys, we made it into our hotel. So you walk in, there's a pull-out couch right there. There's a desk, a little drawer area, I put my backpack there. We have a sink with the microwave, mini fridge. And then, excuse me, scoozy, scoozy. We got two double beds. Um, then we have like a TV right here. You could turn the TV. Like a small little closet area. <laughs> Got another sink. And a mirror right here. And then you have the shower bathroom. So this will do for the week for us. Good morning, guys. Welcome to day one, our full first day here in Atlanta. Ruben driving. We got Reagan. We got Rosie back there. It is 109 p.m. <clears throat> Waffle House right there. But we literally slept in East Coast time till like 11, 12. You woke us up at like 11 something. 
because we on Cali time. So, you know, they're three hours ahead. So, me and the girls were up to like, well, I went to sleep around two in the morning. They were still up. <laughs> so, yeah, like four. So, one, our, 1 a.m. our time. So, yeah, so now we are up and we're trying to go find some brunch. Um, it's like 1 10 p.m. So, we're about to go find something to eat. Where are we going? Milk and honey. Yeah, we're going to milk and honey. Um, and yeah, and we don't know what we're doing today. We're just going to cruise around and see and eat. And, hook up with uh, and hook up with his sister's friend uh, who lives out this way. So she can, you know, introduce us and we can learn some stuff and see around what locals do. Because right now, oh, here's that other place last, from last night. Um, so yeah. All right, you guys, so we ate, we are full. More, some are more full than others. <laughs> and now we're about to take a little walking tour on the Martin Luther King Jr. Uh, National Historic Site area. All right, guys, like I said, we're doing our little walking tour. house my girls are up there already we're gonna take a picture in front of this house so we parked up that way by Martin Luther King Jr's birthplace the home where he was born and now we're walking to the park the whole Memorial Park which is only a couple of blocks away
sorry guys day one is complete it is 9 31 eastern standard time we are about to go to bed it's 6 30 hour time pacific standard time cali time but we have to get up super early in the morning for these tours tomorrow so we'll see you guys in the morning good morning welcome to day full day two it's Monday. We are up. Everybody's dressed. We're about to go downstairs and get some breakfast. And then we have to drive over to where all the colleges are, find parking, um, and go through all the stuff. Make sure we get there early because they will cancel your tour if you are late. So we have to be 15 minutes early and on time and ready to go. the Welcome Center for Spellman. So exciting. guys so we are in Spelman and this is the house where they filmed um, a different world like the very beginning seasons of it it's called the Bessie Strong house and it's this nice porch oh I'm sorry Bessie Strong Hall so that's the front of it and those are the steps where like um they did like the little step show thing and everything like that the little girl even told us they did some filming inside of it good morning all it is day three full day three here um it's tuesday we are up i've been up um, i actually went to bed pretty early last night we're trying to adjust to the time difference we're on the east coast it's a three hour ahead of us so when it's like 9, 10 o'clock at night, it's only like 7 for us. So we're still trying to adjust. Um, it's 1 o'clock right now. So we're waiting on everybody to get ready so we can go out and get something to eat. And then we were invited to dinner tonight by um, a friend of the family. So we're going to do that. And I guess just walk around like downtown Atlanta and see what we could get into today. But yeah, we have no more plans for the rest of this week. Um, weather depending, we might try to drive, fingers crossed, to New Orleans for this other tour that we signed up for. But if the weather is bad, it might not be a go. So we'll see how that goes. But yeah, today is going to be pretty chill. Nothing major. I think that's how the rest of the week is going to be too. All right, you guys, although we're in the car, can't come to Atlanta and not see the Fox Theater. Drive past it, walk past it, something. All right, time to get our eat on. We are going into this place called Mary Max Tea Room. Go we'll see how that is. Look at that building right there. I forgot how to do this. Nothing. Cheese. 
All right, guys, so we just finished eating at Mary Max, and we walked up, I think it's maybe like two blocks or so, two, three blocks up to the Fox Theater. So we made it to the Fox. We're at Fox Theater. And it's raining right now, if you can't tell, so we look mad crazy out here. My daughters like to talk so much crap. Boring. Anyways, but we out here in these ATL streets in the rain on Peachtree Street. And now it's time to put this camera up before it gets too wet. All right, you guys, we're about to get on this guy's view. <laughs> we should do it at night, so Reagan. No. Reagan, how you feel? <laughs> I don't like heights. There they go, there they go. Uh oh. <laughs> don't press the red, Reagan. <laughs> So You're right. right. <laughs> <laughs> so giggly. Yeah, I see how we had alcohol. Uh oh. Here we go. Look at the I gotta record you because this is just too funny. Girl, we in the time. Rosie just sitting <laughs> like it ain't nothing. <laughs> Ooh, I'm going backwards too. Mm -mm. Wait, it's a little foggy. <laughs> Oh, my booty on the back. Oh, you can see everything. You don't got no things to hold on to. Just the case of the phone. The present shush. <laughs> Not the phone. Oh my God. Yeah, we up there, but oh, we ain't even at the top top. Let me just be down. The Centennial Park is down there. <clears throat> and then the Coca-Cola over there. Oh, the aquarium is right there. That big building right there. This is what's happening. Oh, this is what mighty happened. Alright guys, so we just got off of that. And then I think while we were in there, I was showing you guys we are at Centennial Park. It's down here. So that's everything behind. And then the college football hall of fame is back there. So yeah, we're about to, the rain has stopped for a minute. So we're about to check this out right now. Mm -hmm. Looks like those whole thingies, there's a bunch. And it looks, seem like that's where we, doesn't it seem like that's where they would have put like the flames, right? Yeah, that's where the flames All the are. flames would have lined it. Yep, that's where the flames are. That's what Bugs going to one day. And then all that over there. It's really nice over here. They have all the flowers out and things. Yeah, I just looked down and saw these numbers. Now the question is, what do these numbers mean? If anybody knows that answer, comment down below. If not, I'm going to have to find something that will tell us what these numbers mean. And then even right there, there's like a little <laughs> column and that has a number on it as well. I don't know if you guys can see the sun is kind of trying to peak a little bit. It's cold and overcast today. This little girl. I'm gonna be making all kind of noise while I'm recording. <laughs> I like so. the oh. That's the college football hall of fame. So now we came up on all of these names and people. It looks like companies. Georgia Governor Nathan Deal. It's all in divine order. Wait, what is this again? My bad, I forgot. This is the Olympics Hall of Fame. No. Wait. What is it? The so, Olympics? yeah. The, this is really nice with all these names. Goes from there. 12. All the way over there. And then that's CNN up there.
And then again, College Hall of Fame is super dark, so. That's pretty. This is a All right, guys, so we made it in front of the CNN building. Got that. Rosie just took a picture. All right, guys, we are walking up to the State Farm Arena. It's massive, so I can't get it all. This is where the Hawks play, apparently. And I really care much about basketball. And then all the way over there is the Mercedes Benz Arena. So we couldn't come to the Atlanta area and not go to Lenox Square. Linux Mall. So we're about to see what they got up in here, what they talking about. Alright guys, so we are in the Buckhead area. We just left the mall. And we are going to a place called The Yard. Razi heard about this spot. It's called the Yard Milkshake Bar. So we're about to see what this hitting for. This is a cute little plaza though. Cute area. Good morning, good morning everybody. Happy Wednesday. It's been a struggle getting these girls up and getting them out. The first couple of days was hard for me and now it's gotten better. But we are about to go get something to eat. We are on our way to breakfast, boys. Oh yeah. All right, guys, so we came to see where Creflo Dollars Church is, and this is it. It is massive. Looks like they're cutting down some trees. Royal Changers Church has a bookstore. That's a blessing. Really big. Really beautiful. This whole It's dark. So, yeah, they're doing some work out here, but yeah, all this land. All of that back there. All right, peeps, we just made it to Roswell, Georgia. And we're going to the Smith Plantation, which really doesn't look like a plantation. I think this is through the city and it was like pretty cheap about 30 minute drive or so out of the city so we're about to go check it out I found that these hogs were wild and would not feed so they were killed Davy and Moses butchered the hogs and hung bacon and ham above the pit in the smokehouse I believe the meat should last us a while that was Archibald Smith writing in his farm journal in 1840 Although various kinds of meat might be smoked, the plantation smokehouse was mainly filled with hog meat. The smells wasted little of it. It was a small compared to other operations. Holdings between three and 
Look at the iron. Iron. It's got iron. Right there. You gonna take the trail down there? It's like a little water or whatever right there. Yeah. We just came out of this greenhouse. And then this was a slave cabin. And they have a lot of things on the wall to tell you about the history, but very small in here even the beams are like right above my head and this right here tells you about the economy so can you imagine what those prices will be today no, sheesh gonna, yeah we're gonna try that so it's gonna be the car okay so the girls got me doing this trail and Rosie just noticed like the rocks and things right here how it could have been a stream. What does it say? It's just, I think it's like... Oh, garden? Yeah, but like to tell who like their dogs are going on. Oh, okay. No, those are plants. Oh. Oh yeah, like that's a fern. It has little markers in there too that tell you. Oh yeah. Look at my girl. It, feels good, it does. It feels nice. Yeah, all these little bugs flying around. I can't. Mm -mm. Ooh, uh uh. Okay, they all on these trees, honey. Oh, mm mm. Reagan, look at right there. On this tree. Baby, let me. Okay, I'm turning around. No, you're do this Come here, look, mom. look, look, look. Mm -hmm. No, ma'am. And right here, look at that. Ooh, nope. I'm, I'm good. I was trying to. Okay, guys. So we just did the guided cell phone tour outdoor. We didn't go inside to do the house tour. It wasn't exactly what we thought it was gonna be. So. I think he's in the car, we're about to find something else to do. all day we've been taking it easy our last full day here and as you can see it is raining we are on our way to um our family friend's house and then we're going to dinner you guys can see that break up there but yeah it's rain but it's 72 degrees and it's humid so rosie back there talking she loves this weather but yeah so that's what we're doing right now we just chilling our last full day here and resting catching up on sleep and watching movies and things like that and then we're gonna be headed to dinner shortly good morning good morning this is our last day here in Atlanta so we are up starting to pack well we started packing last night me and the girls um, so trying to finish packing and take our showers we check out of the hotel in like two hours um, we asked for a late checkout 
and then we're gonna go get something to eat but for right now i'm just drinking a protein shake Reagan got my last one um and yeah and we're just gonna go get something to eat and then probably just drive around the city again just to take some final sights in um before we head to the airport this evening so that's what we're doing today i didn't vlog yesterday because we literally Reagan, what time do we wake up like we let like 2, 2 p.m. So I woke up at like 8 30 a.m. East Coast time, and then we really didn't get up and do anything until about 2 33 o'clock um, in the afternoon. So it was just a relaxing, lay in the bed all day kind of day, watching movies or whatever. Uh, they were just catching up on sleep. So, and then we went to dinner last night. But other than that, today just gonna be an easy, chill day. We're just um, traveling back home and that should be the end of our trip i want to see if Razi wants to go back by the campuses again just to kind of get another feel um we saw them when we came in i think we drove there sunday and then we drove and we saw it on monday um and today's friday so just kind of seeing again what it looks like at the end of the week and you know just see how she feels about it again just one more go around and then definitely get something to eat and then just probably walk around and just see what we could do before we head to the airport. But yeah, I'll take you guys along with us today. Nothing much going on besides traveling. Alright guys, so it is Saturday. We made it back home. I just had to come back on and say thank you guys so much for watching this video. I am now at 450 subscribers. Um, so thank you so much for watching. And everybody, welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe. Share my channel. I'm trying to build and get to 1,000. We're on the road to 500. We're 50 away. But I'm really trying to get to 1,000. And there's Layla. So yeah, my house is a hot mess, but thank you guys for watching and fingers crossed. Um, I did a poll on my Instagram to see which school Rosie might choose. Though Spellman and Clark are only two of the ones that we saw. Um, every bugs, I'm, I'm vlogging. Every school she's applied to so far, she's gotten into. So she has a long list. Those are just two of the ones that she really wanted to see, especially since they're so close and we were down there. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys all in the next vlog. Banana. Banana. Bye, guys. Mwah. Mwah.